Welcome to Australian Opal Cutters. At Australian Opal Cutters, we decided years ago that people needed to have information about opal. Why do they need information? Because opal is such a rare gemstone. Very little is said about it. Nothing much is advertised about it. And it's just one of those, those niche gemstones that people don't see very much, no matter where you are in the world, even in Australia. And all the good opal, even in Australia, goes overseas to places like America and Japan and Germany. So we needed to give people a lesson on the types of opal we cut. So we invite you in to come and see opal, learn about it, the types of opal we cut, the, the real compared to the fake, and really get a lesson so that in a few minutes we can make you an instant expert. Well, at least relative to just most people in the world who know literally nothing about opal. And I can tell you as a passionate opal cutter and dealer and collector, opal is so unique that it should be worth millions more than it is. However, the demand's not there. Why is the demand not there? Because there's not enough of it to create a demand. Why is the demand so high for diamonds? Because there's so much of it that if you don't create a demand, it'll be worthless. So the diamond cartel have made such a lot of big effort and spent so much money creating a demand that's never been created for opal. So get in on this niche gemstone, which is way, way over undervalued. And, uh, and, and there's really so little demand for such a beautiful, unique gemstone that it staggers the mind. But I'll tell you a funny thing. When opal comes more available, when we find a new find of opal, the price of opal actually then goes up. You think, well, there's more of it, it should come down. No, because suddenly people know, jewelers know that they can get opal. So the price goes up because they start wanting it. So come and get it while that's not happening.